had one orange that was going bad. Hey, RC. I don't have no apples for RC. Just don't feel right about this cash. Something, something is not right. The cow. We got a visitor. Ah, it's old 19. I wasn't watching. Oh. And we're gonna make a U-turn and head to the house. Look at y'all. There's a coyote. That looks like a bunch of mountain goats up there. Yeah, I'm getting ready to unroll a roll. I've got bulls out here playing with my they're bumping and rubbing on the thing tractor it's a pretty good little hill it should go good there you go somebody's pushing it Well, they're not pushing it much. I think somebody's getting ready to roll it. Man, it's about 65 degrees. 4.30 in the evening. Sun going down. Move, move, guys. Look out. There's a little cave. Hey, somebody roll that bell. Come on. I'm gonna give it a push. Here we go. Move, cow. There it goes. We didn't got dry, we got dust coming up. Oh yeah, good bell. Hey, everybody's happy. I could have a new cat down here, I'm not sure. I'll find out here in a minute. That's number 40. I can tell she's had a calf. That cow calf right over yonder. Number 10. She don't even look like she's got a lot of milk. I don't know. I'm going to have to watch. First off, this cow might have had twins or something. That calf was nursing her. That other cow, I don't know. She don't. I don't know if she's got much milk or not. 
I hope I don't have something funny going on. I'll tell you what I did. I've got. It's about to get dark. I just don't feel right about this cash. Something. Something is not right. The cow. It acts like it's her calf. I don't even. She don't look like she's had a calf. She may have. I hope she has. I've got some colostrum. It's about to get dark, but I mixed up some colostrum, and I'm gonna see if he'll take a bottle. The calf acts like he's hungry. I don't know if he is or not. But I'm gonna try to give him a bottle. What I thought. Come here, buddy. Cash hungry. He's hungry. I don't know if y'all can see or not. He's taking a bottle really good. If she'll let him, when he gets through with this bottle, she'll start. He'll start nursing her. If she's got any milk. Now here we go. So, that old cow, see he's hungry, he's got to taste this milk. <sighs> yeah, I'm up here, I'm going to put some feed in here for these calves. <clears throat> They're nowhere around, but I think I see two or three of them coming right there. <clears throat> we'll sit up here. I can hear another one coming. Uh oh. <laughs> we got a visitor. Ah, it's an old 19. I wasn't watching. I thought I saw. Come here, 19. Come here. She's always checking my buckets. <laughs> Come here, I'll put you some on the ground, girl. If you'll just let me get that bucket. Come here, 19. Oh. She's not going to take her head. She's going to get feed all in my floor with it. Uh. Come here. 
I got it. I'm gonna put it on some on the ground. She goes nuts over. Oh my! I don't mind giving you a bite, girl. If you just stand back. Ooh. That's 19. She slipped up on me. I had a whole bunch of uh, lemon peel, orange peel. Hey, split here. I had one orange that was going bad. Hey, RC. I don't have no apples for RC. She thinks this camera is an apple. No. No. No, no. Yes. I don't have anything for you. I ain't rub on you. That feels good, don't it? Yeah, it feels good. Scrape your neck. Yeah, it feels good. Yes, sir. -y. Hey, I'm back. Well, he took, he took that whole bottle, pretty much. I don't think a cow's got much milk. Let's go and play it by ear. As long as he'll take a bottle like that. Well, I'm up here on the hill again. Up here in the nosebleed section. My old cows are on the way up. We're going to turn a bell loose. I got my heavy string right here next to the tractor. So we got to go to the right. That's why I'm sitting. This is some second cutting last year hay. It's got some Johnson grass. It's got a little of that Dallas grass in it, probably. Real pretty hay. Let me sit you down here on the ground. There comes my cows down here. I dropped the, I set that bell off right there. It's on the rear. This is steep, steep ground. And this bell is gonna fly. Here we go, everybody's out of the way, it looks like. Okay. There we go. 
look out cows. And went all the way down the hill. That's this hillside, they can't lay on it. <laughs> You, you don't see any a cow trying to lay down on this steep ground. They barely can. Look at that one just fell down right there. She actually got tripled up and fell in it. I don't know if y'all seen it or not. It's steep. <laughs> you can see them cows. I could see one of them cows stumbling, falling down. She'd probably roll 50 foot before she'd get stopped. That looked like a bunch of mountain goats up there. <laughs> it is steep. Putting that hay on her was good, though. Spread out some seeds and then they'll tromp it in the ground. About three o'clock in the evening. 70 degrees. There's my little flowers by the creek. They're trying to open up. <clears throat> We're gonna walk over here and see if uh, see if Jan's at home. It's warm. She could be out. Uh, very possibly could be out. But I don't see her. Right there is where she lives. Now, I don't know where she's went. I haven't seen her the last three times I've looked for her. kind of like it's warmed up some she may have totally moved these buttercups here are blooming out everywhere and we're gonna make a u-turn and head to the house look at y'all there's a coyote i don't know if y'all can see Got a lot of coyotes, I don't have no use for them. My guys that deer hunt up here normally shoot a bunch of them. I, if I had a rifle with me, I might get a shot at him, but I don't. That's yonder he is. He's not running off too good. Went through the fence. Rarely do I ever see one, but you'll hear them. He was up here actually trying to eat some hay. <clears throat> Good, that's a good two quarts. Good high powder milk. I think you maybe's getting a little bit. Hey, you're welcome, buddy. I'm gonna try to help you out. Yeah, I'm gonna help you out. You're welcome. I didn't only give him one bottle yesterday. I may give him another, another one today if it works out. She, I don't think she's got enough milk in her neck. Hi, everyone. This is Mrs. Dave, or Mrs. Editor. My real name is Sue, or Mama, or Bammy. But anyway, I am going to start including, we have about six or seven or eight outros that we did for Outdoors with the Morgans. And I know that a lot of y'all have not seen those. That's actually how Dave and R.C. got their start. 
was on outdoors with the Morgans. So um, I came home one day from work, and Dave, Dave said, I want to do an outro. And I'm going like, no, we don't have time for that. And I come home a couple days later, I want to do an outro. And I'm going, no, we're not doing an outro. <laughs> so anyway, we ended up doing an outro, several of them actually. But they were just getting a feel for their viewers and having them participate in their video. And so we did. And everybody loved RC. So we ended up doing a little kind of a mini series. About every two or three weeks, we would send them an, uh, an outro. And uh, everybody just loved it. And then we have kind of grown from then. And I will admit, I went into this YouTube channel kind of kicking and screaming. I did not want to do this, but we have had a blast. And um, I wouldn't try to experience for anything. It's it's been fun. It it kind of it uh, it it is what it is. <laughs> so, so enjoy our outros, and um, they're from Outdoors with the Morgans. So check them out. They're great people, Mike and Melissa Morgan. And thank you for giving us our start with RC and Dave, and the adventures of Dave and RC on YouTube. Who'd have thought? Thanks. Hey, I'm David. I'm out here with 19 and her friends, and we're in a little area, uh, kind of off the main road in a flat called Flat Creek. Southern Middle Tennessee. We just got done watching another episode of Outdoors with the Morgans. Hey, if y'all like what you say it here, take and like, subscribe, and tell your friends. <laughs>